Hi, I'm Brett Manning, and today I want to talk to you about head voice. In the male head voice, sometimes we think, is that falsetto? Or is that a full voice that's tilting towards head voice? And what is mix anyway? Well, we can talk about pure resonances versus more chord tension and qualities and whatnot. But if I'm airy, hey, hey, it's very clear that I'm in falsetto. Falsetto, the first reward for going into falsetto is right when you tighten up in your chest voice. Then you loosen up into falsetto and it's easier, but every note higher is going to get harder. So if I said, it got easier. As I go higher, it's going to get harder. So one of the differences between what we call head voice, a pure legit sounding, almost female sounding classical head voice. One of the differences between that and falsetto is the demarcation of chord closure, which you hear us talk about all the time. So if I say, hey, the chords burst apart. If I can say, hey, there's more quality. At that point, I can begin to lean against it with additional resonance, the pharyngeal resonance, that and, and you'll hear more fullness. As you begin to hear someone lean going and add more resonance, they're picking up more vocal cord vibration. They're leaning heavier into that. There's less squeeze, therefore there's less vocal cord activation. Too much squeeze tightens the voice. Quite frankly, what you want to have is freedom and release with healthy cord, not tension, but compression. I don't mind using the word tension, but people think tension's a bad thing. Well kind of depends. If it's strain tension, yes. If it's natural compression or chord closure, or some will, will say t focused tone. They say focus your tone. But what they mean when they're saying focus your tone is close the chords. If they're going, ha, ah, ah, ha, they'll say sing out. When one person was telling one of my clients, she said sing out in the studio. And so she was like, ah, she was yelling. What she needed was chord closure. My goal is to find something that will bring consistency. So if I can just keep that little squeak, the e, 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 and I want to hear the uh, 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 the precise staccato in the head voice, and along with melodies. In other words, I can practice going e, or some might come early into the studio one morning and hear me saying, 